Penn Islands Hospital in Clearfield County has announced the elimination of dozens of jobs. Administrators for the hospital say those cuts will save more than $3 million a year. Devin Clark is live in Clearfield County to tell us more about this. Devin? Well, Jen, Marty, these cuts will reduce the staff and services available at the hospital. But hospital directors say that these changes are necessary to ensure the hospital's survival. Now, according to a press release, a total of 30 jobs will be cut and the hours of 50 employees will be reduced. Also, 11 positions that will soon become vacant will not be refilled. In addition to the staffing changes, the ICU at Penn Highlands Clearfield will be closing and those patients will be cared for in a special room in special rooms, rather. In a statement released by the CEO of Penn Highlands Healthcare, these changes are the result of a $28 million loss in operational revenue since 2008. He attributes those losses to a decline in patient and inpatient care, shorter lengths of stay, reduced reimbursement from private and government insurers, as well as an increase of bad debt blaming a good portion of these problems on Obamacare. Now, as far as the employees whose jobs will be affected, in a statement, the president of Penn Highlands Clearfield, Gary Machoy, said, we regret the hardship affected the affected employees and their families will face as a result of these changes. However, these actions are necessary if we are to preserve the financial integrity of the hospital. And no one likes change, but not taking such essential action would be irresponsible and would represent a real threat to the continuation of health care services in the Clearfield region. Now, according to Machoice, the workforce adjustment is expected to result in a savings of $3.1 million this year. Reporting live in Clearfield from the Clearfield County Newsroom, Devin Clark, 6 News.